everyone. So I'm back with part two, uh, showing you um, my uh, journal collection for Christmas 2020. So these are the two uh, poinsettia journals. They are, of course, a little bit different. There's no pocket on the front, but any of the inserts that are uh, on the in the pocket on the front of the other journals uh, in my previous video uh, are inside of these journals. So let me walk you through the, the green one and then I will do a quick flip through uh, for you of the pink one. So I've done a little bit of a different uh, trim on the front. Um, the trim goes all the way around and then the closure is, is this tie. So these of course um, have um, October afternoon papers in them as I mentioned in my previous um, video. Similar inserts, similar um, clips and trims. Here I've added uh, this vintage playing card, a tag, and then this journaling card. And a Cavallini bag. Uh, again, I don't have anything in them. Uh, and I've used, as I did in the other journals, some of the uh, paper labels from the October afternoon uh, collections. Um, the first Noel there from one of the collections. I've used some slightly different um, journaling cards in these ones just because they I felt that they were different enough um, that uh, I should use some some different different trims and different uh, journaling cards. Um, but lots of very similar things as well. Uh, things clipped in, little tabs here. Um, same uh, calendar page. Uh, of course, all of the uh, vintage labels are different because they are uh, vintage and kind of one of a kinds that I, I found. Another of the uh, work basket pages. I've done the same uh, tag here. This is a, a vintage uh, uh, bottle cap here. And inside uh, these two, this is a printable from the old design shop uh, I've included uh, in that envelope. Another vintage recipe page, and Cavallini uh, tag as a tab. And then I've used Christmas shopping list uh, as some extra pages here. And I've added the same candy cane and coaster and journaling card there that I used in the others. Little bow with a bell on it on that clip. Here I've added uh, the same envelope, another doily, and then this is a vintage tally card. Uh, so I've used those um, in in these journals as well. I've added um, the fabric pocket to the inside of these journals, uh, and you can see that I've I've used the same the same inserts. Here, uh, that's a printable, and I've used uh, this different journaling card. I think that's so pretty. Uh, this is again a different journaling card with a little fabric tab and the inserts here. Uh, that, that fun retro um, shopper. Another tag that I've made from the October afternoon papers. One of the vintage sale price tags and then this is the vintage uh, present label. And here uh, I've done another button paper clip, the same uh, waitress pad, uh, and that is the um, recipe that I've added uh, to this one. So that is the green uh, poinsettia. And let me take you through the pink poinsettia. Very similar. Those are all the same. And this is the vintage label there. 
lots of fun making these, um, but boy, a lot of work to do kind of all the, the buttons and all the little trims and all the little clips and so on. But I just love the way that these have turned out. Uh, and I hope you like them as well. I think this year, more than any other year, I think we need lots of fun, bright, happy things uh, in our life. Uh, so that's really kind of what got me using uh, these really very traditional, bright, happy, happy colors. Uh, that is a vintage uh, bottle cap. Um, another vintage uh, recipe page. Another Cavallini tag. And these are the same clips. And this is the, the fabric pocket. I'm sorry if I've been a little bit out of frame on these. I apologize for that. Um, and these uh, same inserts as before. The vintage tally card there um, but I will have photos um, of the of the insides of course of all of these journals in the Etsy listings so that you can see a little bit more detail hopefully and I apologize for the lighting we have a really dreary day here today but I did want to get this video up so that you could see um, what's in my shop uh, and this is the the vintage uh, present label and here, um, I love this. This is um, vintage. It's mincemeat uh, pillows recipe that has been taped uh, onto this um, recipe card. Uh, and I got that, I think, in a package of something that I got from the paper basket as well. So lots of fun vintage items in these as well. So that is... Um, the flip through of the two poinsettia journals. Uh, as I mentioned, I will have everything listed in the description box below. Uh, these are in my Etsy shop when this video goes up. So I've got my shop listed below. I'm going to list Black Ink Papery, where I got the October afternoon papers this summer, uh, as well as Molly's Mantle, where I got a lot of the really fun, cute printables. Uh, and the paper basket where I got a lot of the, the authentic vintage items. So thank you everyone for joining me. I hope you are all well. Please take care of yourselves. Um, have a wonderful Merry Christmas, uh, and I will see you probably not until the new year again, um, but I wish you all a happy holiday season.